What is going on, guys? Me just came back here with another video. Today, um, you can probably see what we're doing by the title and by this box. We are doing an unboxing review of the Power Rangers Ninja Steel toy. I know I'm a bit late to this. The Lux Ninja Steel Battle Morpher, but I know I'm a bit late to this. Um, sorry, I wasn't. I was more watching and I was more in Dino Charge then. But now we got to, we got it, and I will be reviewing it, so let me take out the Power Stars. I will actually be doing a review, or, yeah, uh, I will be checking these out and comparing them. But let's take the... handle take the handle rip these little things off these little it's connected to these things kind of like like the little zip tie thingy but they're like super small so I got the handle off now this is the little peg that it comes with now it shows how to put it on but I'm good and I hope you can actually... No, okay. Um, this is bad. I might need to go get some scissors and I cannot cut the video. And I'm gonna have to... I'll be back, guys. I'm back. Uh, give me a sec because I'm having trouble trying to find the scissors. Found them! this maybe it's important I don't really think it is let's see what do you do now oh let's see if I can actually cut 
cut this. Yeah. All we need is this little peg. Actually, first we need to take this out. Which, I don't know. Oh. And the scissors again. It's kind of hard to unbox this, actually. I did not expect it to be this hard to unbox. Ow. Mm. Dang, this, this, this tape here was hard to, like, actually open. Like, actually, like, Oh, I need the scissors again. And, oh yeah, Instructions, but we don't need those. This is really hard. Not gonna lie. Oh, well, and that fell. This one's really hard. Okay. Might not be able to get this on that side. But maybe just. This is really hard. We don't need this anymore. And, uh, yeah. So. Let's, um, let's, uh, do this. Uh, I don't know how to position the camera. That's, um, that's a problem. Let's do that for a second, so I can do something here, and so I can put this thing handle on, and this peg. It's hard to put on. Okay, let me turn this thing off. Guys, because it's getting annoying. I hope that's enough 
it's really in there. It does got a grip. Now, this peg is going to be hard to put on. Guys, it's already been 10 minutes of, rec of me recording. Oh, yeah, and also while I'm doing this, please leave a like, subscribe, and... I'm pretty sure comments are disabled because of YouTube. Um, because um, for videos made for kids, so videos made for kids have the comments disabled. That's why. Well, I actually got the peg in. Now I gotta get it in through the other side. Might not be too hard. Shouldn't be too hard. Kinda is a uh, thing. This is hard. Really hard. I'll be back again. Okay, I'm back, guys. Maybe I should put the plate in first. Go in. Oh, okay. I wonder what. Um, I'll set it like this, I guess. And I'll just like do everything. Yes. So, here's the toy. Um, there's actually a little switch back here. Ow, oh, that's loud. And that was really. My hand kind of small for it. I have to go, and actually it's kind of for the left, but I have to like actually do this because not nah, it's going to feel uncomfortable. So, and that's how big my hand is. So, yeah. Um, it has like, so there's a few different modes, but let's put this aside and put the stars out. Now, see, um, so here's, I'll start with the yellow power star. The yellow power star, it's not, it's really cheap looking. It, it's got the foam, obviously, so like, say kids want to throw it. And if they hit each other, it's not going to hurt, you know. Um, really actually cheap looking. Um, I don't have Japanese Power Stars, but I can't really do comparison like that. Um, you know, this is supposed to be able to flip up on the just, you know, and, um, 
yeah, so, same thing with the Red Ninja Power Star, you know, it's got, like, these Japanese symbols, whatever that says, I don't know, Red Ranger, pretty cheap, too, um, these little lines over here, on the back, is the things that read on the marker, whatever, remember, so this one, comparison, long line, just like that, nothing on the side, little lines, and little lines on the sides, it's, that's the only difference um, between those. So, three noises, on the, if, if you push this trigger, so this. Okay, so, yeah. So there's those three noises. It's gonna be like this, you can push the trigger. And yeah. And this is actually really hard to get in, not gonna lie. So if you ever like really get this or something, just, just get someone to help you. Unless you know you got it, but sometimes those little that little black peg pegs can bend can bend when you put it in. And uh see Let's start with putting the power stars in. Um, okay, so. Start. So, it's going to go like this. Okay. And then you want to spin it as fast as you can until you hear it. So it says Red Ninja Power Star, and then press this little trigger button, activate, activate and it makes this little noise. It says this. Hold on, let me wait till it's done. Yeah, it says the same thing. It says the same same thing, but it says Yellow Ninja Power Star. That's all it says. Same noises. If you press it, if you press it, uh, press it. Come on, where is it? Where is it? Uh, I don't know, but if you sometimes if you press it, it's gonna play the sound again. It's really hard to get out. There we go. Boom. And then you got the yellow ninja power star. So let's do the yellow ninja power star. Okay. Wait, what? Oh. I'm gonna take it out. And it makes a noise when you take it out. And when you put it in, so. Ugh. Okay, it won't do it this time. Yellow Ninja Power Star. Activate. See, same noises. I don't think it'll play any... Different noises if you have the power star. Okay. So I'm pretty sure it plays like one diff, just one noise, the same noise. I don't know. I'm not really sure about that. I don't really know. But let's check out the different modes now. Let's put those aside. And, um,. Also, even if you put the power stars and then unlock all these different and do all these different modes, it's not gonna make any more noises. Or if you put them in these modes, it's not gonna make any noises either. Like slashing noises, you know. Okay, so the first one is a is like a claw, which I'm really having a hard time trying to get out. Wait, hold on. Let me do something. Should be that. This one. Okay. So, you, oh, and I'll, let's do the blade first. So this, but this um thing right here is a button. So if you press it, that happens. And the blade is bigger than the Japanese version, but it's also big. Um, they should be using the Japanese toys in the in their shows. So, boom. Pretty cool. I like it. Um, and if this blade right here, you can push it out. You can, like, pull it out. It's 
gonna go like that. And then this blade right here, which, give me a sec. Pull that out, put that back in. Pull this one out, which is gonna be kinda hard because it's really stuck in here. <sighs> there, okay. Pulled it out like this. It's kind of like a Which, I'm not sure if that's, I'm not sure if this is the right way. But yeah, so it's, so if you actually pull it, like, oh, if you actually push the button, and then make it go in blade mode, and then you take it, if you take this one, and try to put, and then you try to put it on claw mode, it's not going to work, since you push the button and put it in blade mode. You actually have to pull it out for it to go in claw mode. So now this will be like the extra claw right there, so it's go like for role play purposes, you know? Which I'm probably gonna role play with this, obviously. Not that obvious, but you know. And play around with it. Um actually, hold on. There's no special special sounds either. Same sounds. Um you can actually put this like you know, they actually took out the bow mode from like they took out the bow mode from this toy, actually, which is kind of sad. Because I was really hoping they would put in a bow mode. But you can still do it like this, like a bow mode. Like how they would in the movie. Hold on. Kind of tilt it real quick. Like that. And then you can obviously twist it. And if this would actually pull out. Like they do that. They have that in the Japanese, except it's not like the movie where it goes like way back. But you can still like role play with it with him, you know. Like you're actually going to do, you know, like shoot a bow. But you can still do that, which is pretty cool. Even though they took out the bow mode from this, and then obviously I already showed you this like a while ago. You can do how you can have like display mode. Like this blade mode, which Ow. yeah, let me boom. You can go like hold it with your left hand or right hand. You go boom, boom, right hand. Yeah, like, boom, boom, you know, like a little blade, sword, this is actually like a weapon, you know, as well as a morpher, and I think that's it, I've been recording for 23 minutes, a 23 minute video, um, other than that, there's like, okay, so, also, boom, so, this one, it has like a little eye or one, um, which is on mode, obviously, and then there's like this little zero, like a lot of toys, and a lot of stuff when you turn them on and off. Um, for, um, it's right there, but you can't really see it because the brightness. There you go. And then you can kind of see right there. It's like a T for try me mode. It'll make that noise still. No, you can't really do anything with try me mode. Um, you can still push this button. Doesn't do anything. Um, the only thing you can do with try me mode is this. And then activate, and then no sounds, nothing. And then there's um, the little zero mode thing, which is actually off. So that's why it doesn't make any noise. You can pull out the blade. You can pull out the claws. No noises. No nothing. Press this. Nothing happens, obviously, because it's off. But um, 
recording for already. Dang, it's already been 25 minutes. Like, not too long ago. Like, not too long ago, I just said it was, like, 23 minutes. And now it's been two minutes from now. Dang. Oh, God. Okay. Well, I'm about to... I'm going to end this video. Here, guys. I'm about to say better not have broken that. Or else I would have been in big trouble. Um, but I think that's it. Um, uh, it's left hand because obviously Japanese toy has bow triggers, so but right left. But I think if it's on my left hand, it's good. And I'll put the power star in. Okay. Ninja spin. Or the show, whatever. Well, uh, yeah. And, um, see you guys in the next time. Peace out. Peace.